Nate. How's it going, everybody? I'm Nate. Uh, I'm only going to record this episode today. Uh, well, I already recorded three episodes. You guys know I record them in usually like three or four episode blocks. To give me self some backlog. Mm hmm. So I will be recording this episode real quick. No, I don't want to skip the event. We're getting attacked, and Adult Q is freaking out. Yeah, you're all boned. Here they come. Coming down the sewer. They're all two dimensional. They know where we are. You totally fucked up. You uh, told them where we were. Yeah, there they are. And we're all dead. Hooray! Everybody gets a big hug. You get a hug. And you get a hug. Good thing they're out here. You're dead. She didn't make it. Dead rip. Spaghetti. All these people, all these adults are huge jerks anyway, so it's fine. Boom. See? Okay, I don't know why I want to go and make that noise, but there you go. And that one's doing a funky flip. Grandmaster Flash. Yeah, you're all boned, Lameo. Why are there Monokumas here? I don't know, Adult M. Children find out about this place. I don't know, lol. Right now. Just run. Everybody run, get out of here, you fools. Don't run into the area where everyone's getting slaughtered. Okay, we'll try. We got a gun at least, lol. Wait, what, sure, come on. Too late, half the people are dead, lol. Nope. Okay, we'll try to kill as many Kumas as we can. Okay, fine. Come on, Jill, you got this. Now's not the time to argue. If we don't fight, our lives are in danger too. Yeah, I'm just gonna be taco then the entire time for this. If it's if it's hard, if there's like more than six monokumas on the screen, then I'm just gonna be taco. Here we go, lol. What's gonna happen? Any animu cutscenes? Anything? Come on. Who's getting attacked? Yeah, yeah. Oh, come on. Come on. What the shit? Crap. Oh, is someone dead already? There you go, you're both dead. I'll get that health in a second. Please save me! Where? I see my parents in Makoto. I can't die yet. No! It just won't stop! What is where are the other idiots coming from? Oh no. At least your Akuma's helping, oh god. Do your best. Why, would, why would I auto-target this one? What the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, no dead. That's okay, we still got some of them, lol. Yeah, we got this idiot. Wait, why did it throw that one from the sky? That was lame. Come here. Want money? It's gonna hurt her. Ah, that blew her up. Thank you for saving everyone. That person just died. So I didn't save everyone. There you go, the secret base defenders. Oh, blam. Half the people are dead, lol. Probably should have used knockback on that bomb Kuma, but that might have hurt the lady too. I don't know. Freaking heck. Who's about dead? Dead. Dead. He's missing a foot. Well, that's fine. He can just get a metal foot or something cool. It's all good, lol. This is terrible. This is so cruel. 
I don't think you're able to save all of them anyway. This is your fault. Whose fault? This whole time I've been so careful keeping this place a secret. I convinced people to stay underground. Stay hidden so they couldn't be followed. Mm -hmm. After all that, this happens. Not my fault, bro. The only explanation is that they followed you! You brought them here! Nah. We... we did? No. When you contacted Future Foundation, the kids must have honed in on you. You sure? They tailed you, and you brought them right back here! Maybe. It's all your fault! You did this to all of us! But that's not fair! I... I didn't want this to happen! Too bad it happened, lol. Protected us, didn't they? Yes. If they never came back after their stupid mission, this place wouldn't have been ambushed. Th that's a baseless accusation. You're just making an assumption. We'll just sweep up all the bodies and we'll be fine. As long as I'm assuming, I guess I'll go one further and say you guys are spies for the kids. Sure. Th that's not funny. What could we possibly gain from that? Nothing. I remember an old folk tale about a war between birds and beasts. Okay, how does it go? In the face of both bird and beast, the bat played both sides. Okay, sounds like he, he, I don't know how a bat could be a bird and a beast. I couldn't see it. I couldn't see it either. In the end, the bat ends up alone. Mm -hmm. What are you trying to say? Bird or beast? I wonder which side you're on. I'm with you. Hey, look, children. Huh? See, some people still survived. What, you're asking me? Don't act like you don't know. Hey, what are you asking? Get, get, get Lock me. Him up. Please, let go of me! Okay, we're in prison now. Overworld under arrest fund. And Tago's fist. Damn it! They take away my stun gun. Then they stuff me into this dusty room. It's okay, Taco. It's dusty. You'll sneeze eventually. Her fault. I hope she chokes on a fish she caught herself. Oh, I guess I don't want her to actually die. Ugh. I gotta focus on Master Biakia now. Not that stupid idiot. I can't just stay trapped in a place like this. I gotta hurry and save me. I, I gotta save. Oh no, she's gonna sneeze. That was close. I was about to sneeze there. No, you still will, Taco. I can't take this dust anymore. I gotta find Omaru and... Yeah, seriously. Why am I thinking about her at a time like this? So irritating. I know. Ask your other personality about it, Taco. I agree. I agree, Kamaru. Yeah, I know, I'm having f still shot flashbacks to people getting murdered. Mm -hmm, I remember. It's not your fault, though. You contacted though. Future Foundation. The kids must have honed in on you. They tailed you, and you brought them right back here. It's all your fault. You did this to all of us. No. Bro, that ain't me. I said that. All my fault. Everyone got hurt because of me. He's right. If I didn't insist on coming back here... It's okay, Kamaru. Then every, those lumens wouldn't be dead, but you're fine. And if I had just tried harder, if I were a better person, I could have protected them. I couldn't do it because oh my I'm God. weak. And what's wrong with that? <laughs> it's okay, Kamaru. It's just like Togo said, I'm so weak. I kept saying, I can't do anything. Always relying on others. I never even thought about saving others. And now this happens. It's alright though. Sneak, sneak. Sneakity sneak. Who's that? Is that Shirakuma? Tra -la -la. Well, oh man. Hello there. Hi Kotoko, how are you My doing? My name is Kotoko Hatsugi. I'm the fighter in the Warriors of Hope. Nice to meet you Kotoko. It matters at all. Mm -hmm. Open sesame! 
Oh man. Bam, bam. Well, that's not open sesame. You've got a gun or a weapon or a hammer or something. Sorry for the intrusion. Thank you very much. Good phonetical spelling there. Phew. I reached way back for that reference. Mm hmm. I had to deal with baby boomers all the time, so my gags are kind of dated. That's okay. And speaking of old... You're also old. Oh, I can't think of any follow-up. I must be nervous. I can write a funny for you, Kotoko. <sighs> my heart is racing faster than 16 shots a second. Master Takahashi would be proud. Who's Master Takahashi? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah I already know what you want to say. You were going to tell me a fighter should be a boy. No, I wasn't going to say that. Boys, I've heard some people say that slugs don't have a gender. Really? Who says that? Slug scientists? Actually, slugs have both male and female bodies at once. Cool. People who go around spreading half-assed lies about slugs deserve swift punishment. No, slugs are cool. Slugs are cool. Fighter kick! Fight punch! Chaka! Hacha! None of those attacks are real. Oh, she fell. Okay, then. Get out of that position. Aw, oh, she's sad. But I told them that I didn't want to be fighter because I'm not good at P.E. You know who was good at P.E.? That kid I mean, who died. I am really good at physical education, though. Yeah, isn't P.E. physical education? Hmm, Kotoko? How about you? You good at health and physical education? Uh, somewhat. Is that... Is that even a subject you can be good at? Yeah, you can get good grades there in it. There are no girls who dislike health and physical education. You sure about that, Kotoko? That's my theory, anyway. It's a terrible theory. Stare. You know who else says that? A lot of other anime girls. What? Truth is, I'm actually here to hunt you down. But I changed my mind. I'll let you escape. Why? But it's not like my feelings about demons have changed any. I still hate them deeply. Okay. I still want to kill them all in the most painful, cruel way possible. Cool, sounds like, fun. For example, drowning them in a septic tank or putting a razor under their fingernails. Okay, or both, and then they get poo in their fingernail injuries. But that's not even enough. I hate them with full power. Alright, cool. Anywho, despite my hatred, the reason I let you escape was because... I'm so cute. You are super adorbs! Yep, that is the reason. Funny. Hooray! Mm -hmm. I love adorable things! I collect everything adorbs, from faucets to toilet seats! Cool, what's the cutest toilet seat you own, Kotoko? So, Okay, with the other one, I'm totally slaughtering lol. Really? Oops, sorry, I cut her off. There is one catch. You're the only one allowed to leave. Four eyes over there is not cute at all. E okay, but Taco's my friend what? though. But shh, keep it a secret, especially from the sage Nagisa. He's super strict with rules. Okay, I won't tell Blue Hair. Nagisa says I can't even drink soda during meals. Why? Soda's the best with meals. Either that or green tea. Yeah, my fault the food is so tasteless. I mean, he could at least let me have a little. Like a tiny sip? He tells me to drink milk, even if I'm eating cereal. It's like drinking curry soup with your curry. Hmm. Yeah, that is a good point. Why would you drink a glass of milk if you're having a bowl of cereal? Um. I don't know, Kamaro. Anyway, let's go. Go on, get out before those chumps notice. Okay, I'm running. Abandon all the people here. Yeah. Oh, oh she's gonna get pissed. Wrong? Is your red flower blooming? What's that mean? Or maybe you just like locked rooms. Like you're a murder mystery enthusiast. Okay. No. Just leave Toko behind. She's my well, friend. I can understand a little hesitation. Why don't you just leave the cell for now? I'm working on it. Step on out. Girls are more adorable if they're a teensy bit selfish. Okay, I'll leave. Is there a save Kuma in this room, huh? No. And now, I get teeth. I mean, I got teeth right in the neck. And now I'm down. I'm okay, though. This is a denture launcher. So how about it? Pretty sweet machine, right? Why would you shoot dentures at people? Is that, a, is that a, a sexual innuendo, Kotoko? I'm pretty sure. <laughs> it's so adorbs, I just can't stand it! 
How can it be? You're shooting dentures at people. That's weird. Ah, by the way, my dad was a dentist. Oh, okay, that makes also, sense. Papa was always cheating with his dental assistant. Okay, sounds good. So I killed him. Well, then he should have strived harder to be a brain surgeon. Great daddy indeed. Neglecting his business and making me earn money instead. Well, you can be an actress and have a rich dad as well. You should have kicked his ass. There's a little, but not killed him. I could kill over and over and over and it still wouldn't have been enough. Okay. What is this? I can't move. Reminds me of that scene in Iki Tucson, but we're not going to talk about that. I'm just going to carry you into the other room. I bet your face is cute even halfway through swimming a stroke. What the hell does that mean? Uh, however. However what? Being adorbs isn't always a good thing. Cute girls go through terrible things. Oh god, is she going to molest me? What is this? And if you're adorable too, you have to protect yourself. On your own. Okay, I'm trying. If you can't, you have to take whatever they give you. Why are you telling me this, Kotoko? It's a shitty rule, but I didn't make it. Adults did. You're 12, don't cuss. So be prepared for that life. Okay. Toko. Toko's not gonna save you. What was that? Toko's just chilling, she doesn't know what's going on. W was someone just talking about me? Yes, I was. Two rooms down, and I'm dead. Uh? Oh man, here comes the sneeze. Boom. He's back, baby. Tons of flashes. Must have been talking about me. <laughs> and what did he say, Joe? I wonder what he's doing while he's calling my name. Jeez, oh, Master is such a perv. What do you think he's doing? I can't just Probably something normal. I gotta get out of here and help Master out. Sounds good, Joe. You do that. She just doesn't stop laughing. There she goes. He's gonna sassy walk out of here. Nope. Yep, she's gonna stab the door. And she cut the door off. That makes sense. Hey, Dekomaru! Let's go see Master now. If you are of use to me, I'll buy you ramen. I'll even add seaweed for you as a top. Hey, she ain't here. Now that's committing to a joke. <laughs> Strange, though. Her scent's still here. Did she perhaps run away on her own? Here's a tablet. Is that like a GPS for Dekomaru's wristband? I see. This'll be good for tailing her. Anyway, you want me to chase after her, don't you? But why are you giving this splendid gift to an enemy like me? Is it perhaps that the other me has some annoying plan hidden up her sleeve? Huh? Maybe. Well, doesn't matter. Our goal is probably the same anyway. <laughs> there she goes. Off into the sunset. These children are creeped out by her, but that's okay. So I guess this is the all Jill chapter. Jill hour. Just, I can't say the other thing. Alright. Oh, she's trapped. Trapped with cute traps. Huh? Huh, indeed. At least the shackles are pink and polka dotted. That's cool. Now then, let's begin with the motivation. Okay, what's the motivation, Kotoko? Is it one of those pulley things? Oh, even her button is giant and sparkly. Panties. Oh god, it is gonna be the molestation machine. Giant hands? Yeah, what the hell? Oh my god. Sorry to disturb you while you're, um, busy. It's time for a tutorial. You can fight a- oh, Jesus. You can fight away the tentacles with the X button and the directional buttons. Oh dear. Tentacles will also attack from the outside of the screen. Use the right stick to switch the display. 
Okay, so right stick scrolls down. Letting Camaro get groped increases the heart meter. You know what that represents, right? If it fills all the way, it's game over. So enjoy yourself, but, you know, keep that in mind. Oh, gross. Time to begin the motivation! Please, no! Okay. This is probably more fun as a touchscreen minigame. Come on. Oh, boobs. Get out of here, boobs. Get out of here. Ugh. Come on, come on. Oh my god. Uh oh, that one's a bad one. Get out of here. You like this? Huh? No, I don't. This is so weird. Why is this a mini game? Oh, she's doing fine. I get to let go of my boobs. Let go of my crotch. Get out of here. I bet this would have been more fun on the Vita because then I could have used the touch screen. Oh god. There you go. We're fine. We only got lightly molested. It's fine. <laughs> So weird. There you go, keeping the ratings down. That's funny. Yeah, you're okay, Kamaru. You only got molested by a 12 year old. This is only not weird. Why? You're persistent. But we're just getting started. Is here comes even more hands. Be slowly but surely motivated. Yeah, what do you mean? Please, enough already. That's the new hotness. Ooh, you're so sexy. Why would a 12 year old say that? I've heard women are the best just before they're ripe. What the hell does that mean? But when they rot, they become demons. I have to figure out the perfect timing. Okay, so you're just gonna trap me to the Gropa machine until I'm an adult? Stop it! Why are you doing this? I don't know. That's what I always asked. I asked them many, many times. Oh my god. Okay, she's using her getting molested as a, a motivation to do that to other people. It's kind of creepy, yeah, actually. Uh, I, I guess. That girl, this is just payback for what happened to me. Uh, that's not if how it works, Kotoko. Then what the adults did to me is wrong too, right? Right. If that's the way it is. There's nothing you can do about it. That's why you just let me go. And we'll beat up all the molesters in the world. It'll be fine. Oh man, she's gonna increase the voltage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Put that lewd body of yours to work, and you'll never go hungry. Screenshot. That's something I should tell myself, but it doesn't work. Way, this is the opposite of child porn, so it's a okay to put in a video game. No problem. What is that okay code to go? It one break the fourth wall. <laughs> yeah. Is it wrong for a kid to be doing this? But it's wrong for adults to be doing this too, right? Right. Both are no good. If you're slapped on the right cheek, slap them on the left, as they say. No. Who says that? No. Did I do the mini game a second time? No, I only have to do it once. Okay, that's good. Here comes Jill. She's flying into business. Way to make an extend episode. Hmm. She can't read that tablet at all. GPS broken or what? It's going like 35 miles an hour. Oh, why is it so fast? Is the Earth spinning away without me? Huh? He's on a train. Bingo! I see, so that's it. Can oh, I save? Monorails are a first for me. <laughs> totally pumps me. Is she gonna be? Is this in our mini game? Nope. She smashed through the window, though. Lol. Look at those legs. He's pissed. <laughs> 